So Prime XPT is a crypto exchange where you can trade crypto futures, the global markets and how all over the future were the day. காபி ட்ரேடிங் இதை பற்றி ஃபர்தராக பார்ப்போம் குளோபல் மார்க்கெட்ஸ் இந்த சென்ஸ் வந்து நீங்கள் எஃபெக்ட்ஸ் ட்ரேட் பண்ணிக்கலாம் சிஎஃப்டி ட்ரேட் பண்ணிக்கலாம் அண்ட் தென் ஆல்சோ கமாடிட்டிஸும் ட்ரேட் பண்ணிக்கலாம் சிஎஃப்டிஸ் இந்த சென்ஸ் வந்து உங்களால் டேக்ஸ் ட்ரேட் பண்ண முடியும் யூஎஸ் ஃபைவ் ஹண்ட்ரட் ட்ரேட் பண்ண முடியும் யூஎஸ் ஹண்ட்ரட் ட்ரேட் பண்ண முடியும் அண்ட் தென் ஆல்சோ யூஎஸ் தேர்ட்டி ட்ரேட் பண்ண முடியும் அவங்களோட வெப்சைட்டில் தி ஹேவ் டுவெண்ட்டி ஃபார் பர் செவன் கஸ்டமர் சர்வீஸ் அண்ட் ஆல்சோ ஃபர்தர் இன்ஃபர்மேஷன் பற்றி தெரிஞ்சுக்கணும்னா ஃப்ரீக்வெண்ட்லி ஆஸ் கொஷின்ஸ் எஃப்ஐ யூஸ் வந்துட்டு பார்த்துக்கோங்க இப்போ உள்ளே போய்ட்டு இதோட டேஷ்போர்ட் எப்படி இருக்குன்னு சொல்லிட்டு ஒரு சின்ன ஓவர் யூ பார்த்துட்டு அண்ட் தென் வீல் கோ இன் டு த இன்ஃபர்மேஷன் அபவுட் தி பூட் கேம்ப் ஸோ இதுதான் அவங்களோட டேஷ்போர்ட் ஸோ ஹியர் வி ஹாவ் தி மெயின் டேஷ்போர்ட் அண்ட் இங்கே நோக்கில் நம்மளோட டோட்டல் ஃபண்ட்ஸ் வந்துட்டு காமிக்கும் அண்ட் தென் வாலட்டோட இன்ஃபர்மேஷன் காமிக்கும் குளோபல் மார்க்கெட்டில் இருக்கிற அக்கௌண்ட் பேலன்ஸோட இன்ஃபர்மேஷன் கிரிப்டோ ஃபியூச்சர்ஸ் மார்க்கெட்டில் இருக்க அக்கௌண்ட்டோட இன்ஃபர்மேஷன் வந்துட்டு காமிக்கும் அண்ட் தென் ட்ரேட்குள்ளே போனோன்னா ஹியர் வி ஹாவ் தி குளோபல் மார்க்கெட்ஸ் ஸோ திஸ் இஸ் ஹவ் இட் லுக்ஸ் லைக் நமக்கு நாலு சார்ட்டிங் வியூ இருக்குது இந்த சார்ட்டிங் வந்து விச் இஸ் பவர்ட் பை ட்ரேடிங் வியூ நீங்கள் இங்கே போய்ட்டு உங்களோட சிம்பிள்ஸ் வந்துட்டு நீங்கள் பார்த்துக்கலாம் அண்ட் ஆல்சோ கிரிப்டோ ஃபியூச்சர்ஸ் போயிட்டிங்கன்னா திஸ் இஸ் ஹவ் இட்ஸ் டேஷ்போர்ட் லுக்ஸ் லைக் அண்ட் இங்கே நான் குள்ளே போயிட்டிங்கன்னா கிரிப்டோ ஃபியூச்சர்ஸோட பேர்ஸ் எல்லாமே இங்கே இருக்குது ஸோ அடுத்து கிரிப்டோ நீங்கள் டேரெக்டாக வந்து இங்கேருந்து பை பண்ணிக்கலாம் உங்களோட கார்டு யூஸ் பண்ணி ஆரல்ஸ் நீங்கள் டேரெக்டாக இங்கேயே வந்துட்டு டெபாசிட் ஆர் ட்ரான்ஸ்ஃபர் வந்துட்டு நீங்கள் பண்ணிக்கலாம் உங்களோட மெயின் பேஜில் இருந்து அண்ட் தேர் முக்கியமான ஃபியூச்சர் இஸ் தேர் காப்பி ட்ரேடிங் ஃபியூச்சர் இங்கே பல ட்ரேடர்ஸோட நல்ல ட்ராக் ரெக்கார்டு வச்சுருக்க ட்ரேடர்ஸோட இன்ஃபர்மேஷன் எல்லாமே இருக்கும் உங்களுக்கு பிடிச்ச ட்ரேடர்ஸை வந்துட்டு நீங்கள் டேரெக்டாக வந்துட்டு போய் ஃபாலோ பண்ணி ட்ரேட் பண்ணிக்கலாம் ஸோ ஒவ்வொருத்தருக்கும் வந்துட்டு ஒரு மினிமம் பேலன்ஸ் வந்துட்டு இருக்கும் ஸோ இவருக்கு வந்துட்டு ஃபிஃப்டி டாலர்ஸ் வந்துட்டு இருக்குது இங்கே ஃபிஃப்டி டாலர்ஸ் பே பண்ணிட்டு அவங்களோட ரிட்டர்ன்ஸை வந்து நீங்கள் என்ஜாய் பண்ணலாம் அண்ட் ஆல்சோ தே கண்டக்ட் கான்டெக்ட் இன் வீக்லி அண்ட் மந்த்லி பேசிஸ் அந்த கான்டெக்ட்ஸில் ஜெயிக்கிறது மூலயமா அவங்களுக்கு அவார்ட்ஸ் அண்ட் ரிவார்ட்ஸ் கிடைக்கிறதுக்கு நிறைய வாய்ப்பு இருக்குது ஸோ திஸ் இஸ் ப்ரைம் எக்ஸ் பிடி Yeah, so first of all, what I'll do is I'll go with the one example, okay? First thing will be one trade example which I took uh, and uh, why I took it and then we'll go to the, you know, in depth about that particular thing, what made me to take that trade, okay? So one good pair was uh, this entire week I traded mostly USD CAD. Somewhat other pairs also I traded but the main focus was on the USD CAD. And I'll give you one point here, see, it is not required to trade 100 trades in a week. with the two trades also you can pass the funding uh i thought of you know uh, sharing my uh, this account details that within five trade i cleared phase one and with the three trades i cleared the phase two so it, it was not that i risk hard you know some five percent or two percent it was with the nominal risk of maximum of one percent only there was not uh, never i took the risk more than one for, uh, percent but the sadly today they don't allow me because some migration process is going with the goat so i cannot log in into the back end so i'm sorry but you just you know trust me on this one that what i made it here okay so it is very important always to wait for the right time at the right place it is not simply that any low, lows and highs is getting taken out that means it's a total soup and you will be buying or you will be selling see most of the time i say buy the lows sell the highs but there are certain rules it is not that every lows you will be keep buying it and every highs you will be selling it you can do that but you should be in a favor of trend where market is going what is market exactly doing and with that mindset you can do that okay and it is also important you should be having your own strategy strategy in the sense see, everybody is having different times let me tell you one of the example like dinesh dinesh is having colleges he cannot trade london example i'm taking oh i'm not telling that he is not taking okay so dinesh cannot trade london that does not mean that dinesh will not be profitable it is just simply that dinesh is having certain times and in the certain times with the certain scenarios he will decide his pair he will decide the time when he is going to trade and you know putting all this together then he'll frame the trade idea and that will give the more edge see edge is nothing but following your plan that is what i say it because many people say edge is like winning 80% or 100% but uh, to me edge is following your plan like what follow up your plan if you made a plan that this week i am going to trade for this pair or with this idea that if price comes to this point say for example when the week starts okay and you decided like today is a sunday and we had a market let us assume that today is sunday and you came to the your system and uh, you made a plan that this is my point of interest 
and i'll be taking the trades if market does in certain way see it does not mean that price comes here then you will take the buys let us assume the price is coming but what is your plan that if price comes to this area and if it takes the liquidity and then it rejects then i'll take it this is ju just example i'm telling okay this is not any model or anything so what is your plan that you will expect the price to come into this area first point second point it should grab the liquidity within that given area and there should be change in a state of delivery that is your plan so what is edge now here following the same plan which you made it on sunday it should not be some random that okay fine today i wanted to trade and come to the chart and start trading it oh fine this is looking sexy let's take it no it's not that way you should always define it see it is good to trade only one trade in a week see averagely you can target some uh, one is to three trades and if you risk it one percent also easily you can make weekly three percent with single trade you do not need to put your you know everything into this one you chill the outside life but come at the right time put the alerts put whatever and come at the right place when your entry comes when your time comes let us assume now dinesh is having colleges in the london session he cannot trade the new york session so what he can do is first point is first of all ask yourself which time which date you can be available into the market see all time all days are tradable but all times and all days can be treated differently not exactly as the same way because it's it, it is having some different phenomena happening again and again and a certain days so that is what is it there is a news okay fine if there is a news what is the news you can plan accordingly if there is no news you will expect market will be in choppy so that is what i mean here so you should have certain plan like Dinesh can come and trade the New York. So what he can do is he can first of all decide the pair, which pair will be moving into the New York session. Let us assume one pair, which is odd JPY. Both pairs are most active into the Asia session. So coming into the New York, he should not be interested in that kind of pair, which will be less active. See, it can move. Price always moves. What I'm trying to say here is it should be more uh, liquidity should be more if liquidity is more then only market moves very fastly from it can move higher lower that is different story but it will move on the liquidity price moves based on the liquidity and imbalances so that is what you decide now let us decide which pair he can select it first pair will be in always in mind usd cad as a new york trader if you are trading the forex it is a very good ideal pair that you can trade in fact you can trade euro usd or any pair which is related to the usd you can trade that but in this case why i selected usd cat because both the pairs is having same kind of time zone which is somewhere into the new york only so that movement will be you know more into the into the uh, new york compare this this moves less into the london if you notice this moves but the more more movement comes into the london so what it makes me that decide the pair now pair is decided now break it down to the price level okay fine this is the price and if price does this i'll go into and then look into the calendar also if there is news expect the manipulation or distribution see anything can happen with the news if manipulation has happened earlier then you will expect the price will distribute with the news but if manipulation is still waiting so news will manipulate the price and with the manipulation it will ex start expanding it and what if nothing is happened so with the news it is possible it can manipulate and distribute both so in the third scenario you should be stay sideline because where it is going to manipulate and where it is going to distribute that also you don't know so these are the certain if and buts you should be having in your mind before trading right this is clear now any doubts in this one anything or because before going into that i'm not going to you know uh, if it is not clear then it will be difficult for you guys to uh, understand the further is it clear like whatever i said it so far yeah okay that will be better just messages uh no voice just text uh, yeah yeah okay clear bro clear fine clear 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 fine right so now let us come to the profiling of the market so profiling is also important see there is three things which happens in the market. I'll just quickly recap the last sessions. What we understand last time is price accumulates, then price manipulates. I clicked it accidentally many times, many places. Let me put it upside. So price manipulates followed by 
and then it always distributes see this is things which i prefer see there are other ways to trade as well what i am trying to say is it's my cup of tea which i trade so i'll be always interested into this kind of things you should not see multiple persons are trading multiple things there are certain person who trades retail patterns that works simply it works somebody is telling it don't work it not works for you it can work for other don't go, get into this sit things that argument and other things everything works but you should be knowing what works for you for me it works so i'll be always interested find out the accumulation and there is two places where i take the entry either at the manipulation or either at the distribution i never take the entry into the accumulation i always wait for accumulation to happen and with the manipulation or distribution say for example i assume that this is going to distribute at this time so manipulation will occur before that time so that is what i'll be having interested okay fine if i'm interested into distribution i'll wait for manipulation and i'll let market to manipulate and then i'll take the entry sometime i am interested into manipulation itself because i want bigger move or i want less risky why i am telling less risky say for example when you take the entry into distribution it's a market structure shift kind of story right so you are taking entry here you are putting your stops here right so technically you are risking price can ret return also but what makes me beneficial into manipulation say for example i entered here so when market gives the structure shift i'll move my stops to the break even right so it's less risky for me when others are making their positions they are putting stops there but my entry is at their stops so ultimately it's a less risky for me because i have moved my stops to the break even even if price reverses i will not be stopped out so that is also part of the plan and i know it can be some sort of confusing or uh, not manageable into the beginning days you need to have some sort of you know some time you give yourself time to make all the things work accordingly and then you can start framing it right so now what can be the ideal scenario last week we discussed accumulation manipulation and distribution asia if you are trading a sessions asia can be the accumulation london can be the manipulation and new york can be the distribution similarly if you trade a weekly profile monday can be the accumulation tuesday can be the manipulation wednesday can be the distribution and that is what exactly i traded here that is what exactly i traded here i traded on this candle this uh, manipulation candle i just took the entry at this candle i'm talking about this candle okay and let me give you the breakdown of what make me to think of that trade and what was the idea behind of this trade so first of all i came to the chart okay let me put uh, this height okay so what i see here uh, say for example if you come to the chart first of all how i frame the trade idea so on that week i was knowing i was in kolkata okay i cannot have much of my time to trade the sessions or i may get involved into certain things and i would not be able to manage my position so what i decided is i'll go with the you know uh, kind of one sort one kill thing for that funding account and that is what i planned it and with the plan what was my expectation first i was wanted price to accumulate then it should manipulate and then it should distribute that was the ideal idea so what can be the best case scenario maybe monday or even certain times what happens now one day before maybe like last day session like friday can we club together like friday and monday can be the accumulation tuesday can be the manipulation and Wednesday and Thursday can be the distribution. That also is possible. See, you try to break it down into this level, na? Certain times, two days can be the accumulation, or everything starts from this way only. Ah, uh, give me one sec. okay so what can be the possibilities that two days can be the manipulation and then it can distribute it right so what i see here is when i came to the chart i started framing my idea overall idea what can be the best case scenarios so first step comes is framing the bias and what a last class i told you clearly how to frame the bias when price is rejecting the lows and breaking the highs that says that price is in a bullish side second point was when price is respecting the bullish pdrs and disrespecting the bearish pdrs that is another way of identifying the trend 
so that says it's a bullish market so what do i see here is price was some sort of accumulation and price has rejected this low see look at this low price rejected this lows so ideally what will be the next aim to look for this highs right simple as that no if and buts right price rejected the lows and what i see here price is rejecting the lows breaking the highs price is rejecting the lows and breaking the highs right in this you can say why don't you target this highs it can be targeted but don't be greedy see plan it in a such a way that can be easily achievable price cannot go see in this one candle it moved that much but it is not always required that price will keep moving in one direction it can retrace as well right before going after this taking this highs it can retrace downside which is pretty possible so why you are necessarily target for this size you look for another trade right so in this case this was my overall idea now second point was when i can take the trade so if it is the weekly profile one shot one kill model means i'll be taking one trade but i'll be aiming for the longer right in one single trade i made 5% right in one single trade i made 5% risking 1% so that means i was very much sure that this will happen and what made me the confident that that was the time which was favoring the model and with the logic which i built it right logic what is the logic price has rejected this loss draw liquidity is the size so my eyes goes to that point right i'll be looking into that eyes now what what is the second idea that monday should we accumulate and tuesday it should manipulate it should take out the monday lows what is the monday low so this was the monday low right so my whole idea was that tuesday price will take out this lows and if it is taking out this lows i'll be buying this lows targeting this highs now my bias is framed in daily i'll go to the one hour i'll go to the one hour and identify the range where is my idea so look at this candle clear range i can see here this is the high this is the low right and price has made another level of equal lows right let us see what exactly happens post that price is accumulating in here to this lows right so when price was when price took out this lows i expected that price, this is the total so and even i allowed till this area because see uh technically price can come to this area but what was here this was a clear range formation so i took it see sometime sometime i take early entries as well so that was the given range see price ranged within this area how many candles 1 2 3 4 5 5, five candle was within this candle and this entire candle was within this given range so this is good area to buy that lows when i say buy the lows i mean to this kind of lows not some random lows so when price took out that lows i just entered after the lows okay and my aim was to target this highs right you you got the point why i targeted that highs and look at the beautiful delivery straight away goes to that point tp post manipulation and what was my entry longing somewhere from this area somewhat delay uh because price was dipping into and my stops was below this body why because i don't wanted price to go below this area i wanted this can be taken out and sometime i count the pip also see ict talks about the stops is sometime when you are not sure how far if there is no pdr see in this case there is no pdr there is no order block if there is order block i prefer to put my stops at the pdr this is not called pdrs or something like that so in that case i am expecting this lows can be taken so ideally 10 to 30 pips can be price can run into that area so allow for that area look at from this pip count one second from this lows this was somewhere around 15 pips so it's a good that price can maximum go to those areas and post that it should target this highs simple first target is done now you can look for the next target what is the next target price can pretty much come to this area right this is what i told you price can come into this direction as well this given points which which is uh, right so now you start sc- 
scaling the positions it is not that price just hit here means you are done with that my next target was this i started scaling the position scaling in the sense i booked some partials and then started targeting this highs simple clear guys any doubts in this one and look how much r it was somewhere around 5 or it was there so one sec some 5 r see and this one trade see when the manipulation happened see see now accumulation manipulation at the right time what i said is it's a us dollar cat so i was expecting some sort of things to be happening within the new york zone on the tuesday at the new york it took out this lows and after taking out this lows where did you get the entry there is a market structure if whether price retraced no not at all where it retraced there was the fpg all will be waiting here that is what when real moves comes nobody gets entry the others will be keep waiting in this area that oh fine entry will come entry will come where this entry came never it retraced or uh, you know you take ict talks about putting the i also take some time it is not that way sometime talks about this uh, uh, waiting into the 50% of area price never came below the 50% once price expanded right so this was one of a good trade which i took it and uh, i gave you the proper reason and planning see it is not some random right you you look it from the plan that i was in kolkata see i stay in chennai but i was in the last week i was in kolkata so my i should i was aware of that i am going to be in kolkata i have to pass that challenge and uh, one more thing i'll show you here uh, generally people go for the you know no time limit challenge but i decided to go with the challenge uh, which is having the time limit because i don't wanted to keep trading it so that is what another thing i took the classic and there was a 30 days and 60 days but it took me that much no within 15 days i passed the both the phases and why i am talking about this particular challenge is that uh, this uh, uh, i posted in my telegram video that phase 2 i'll pass it and phase 1 i posted and then phase 2 i told him that i'll be passing in next few days and after telling then i passed it it is not some random that i did it and then i'm talking here i if you i know many of you are into my telegram group so there i talked so i'll be doing it and i did so this was one of the good example of planning the trade now how do you can plan into in terms of the session so simple as that look it for the sessions with the news and other things if you are a session trader what you will expect is asia yeah asia accumulation manipulation and manipulation should not be some random see even price pokes above this side this is not a market structure shift or liquidity sweep the real moves don't get distracted by this kind of highs market when when times they say i don't know whether icd says or gan said when right time comes price moves or oh, sorry price trend changes so this is what happens all the way so what you can do is accumulation manipulation and distribution and you can apply the same logic where it can manipulate how far it can come down and see i told you with the logic right if you if you see in terms of daily it was more like a logic building instead of trading certain pattern this was not a pattern that is what most people think that turtle soup if you go to try start trading turtle soup you will be start building some sort of uh, pattern oh whether this range how do you define the range see it is not alone a range see i can tell you the ranges are there i define the ranges definitely i mark the ranges and many people ask me this is your range see i'll i'll answer this question because one person asked me in dm so this is your range and you always what you say it first let range to form then range low to are yaar come on range low to be formed range low to be taken and then again smaller range and then this is total soup and this is no see what i mean here is this is my logic that i want price to come into this area 
and this was the range and this was the total soup so it's a more like a logic building not like a pattern that you ask me give me one pattern which is going to work like that no not at all it's a more sort of logic buildings you anticipate why price can come down what it makes it to come down and what will make it to push higher whether time is supporting or not if you ask me what time you look for the london session particularly most of the manipulation occurs in between of 245 to 315 and if you ask me more specific somewhere exact near to the 3 o'clock when the you know london market opens london is in stock markets that time the perfect manipulation happens and then it goes to the higher or lower wherever it has to go and more many of the time and what you do is you come to the chart looking for the structure shift uh, this that and with that you get confused let me show you one example what most of the people do and in fact i was doing i'm not saying that i'm some sort of you know genius guy or something but i stopped doing it because after a lot of you know uh, rejections and a lot of disappointment what i do is i come to the london everybody talked to me everybody has told me asia will be the manipulation that this is not new which i am telling you everybody talks about it and what this is asia in london what you'll expect price will take out the liquidity from any side and there will be a structure shift something like this right and when there is a market structure shift take the entry and then look for the lows this lows are wherever the whichever is the low and what exactly has market does most of the time it will that was the falls uh, it it is just a protraction or whatever you said and see i'm not trying to trade the pattern there is a market has taken out this size that's not a concern for me it should be more logical way what makes price to take out those highs there was nothing there was no pdrs there was no time which was favoring this move then what makes it to go to that highs it can be some random thing why should i concern about that but what happens there was a, just assume that there is a 15 minute this is 15 minute chart and you see that there is a 4 hour fair value gap which is present somewhere like this monday was or you know asia was if i am talking about session asia accumulated fully and this was the structure now so if price coming to take out this lows into this area this is not a market structure shift this is called turtle top and you will look for the highs not to the lows why because there is a proper logic price has accumulated this area see try to understand the logic who makes the profit there are party who makes the profit see market makers need big 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 positions to be filled up right they don't trade one lot or two lots right and to get filled they need liquidity and how to generate the liquidity it's a good case of example let us assume here see what happened here price was accumulated right price gave the market structure shift see people say i'm trading smart money nothing ghanta okay smart money and other things it's a more of the uh, liquidity building what happened here price was accumulated lot of people bought or sold here right definitely every time market is moving upside and downside that means transaction is happening lot of people bought and sold here say for example those who sold will we get stopped out here but those who bought they are running into the profits now what happened it went upside so all those profits which was in profit so they are now profitable right so they will not close the trade they look for the higher prices now what happens london comes there is a liquidity shift and market structure shifts so already there is a stop which is generated here right and now another sort of liquidity pool is getting created out here because lot of people are sorting putting their stop loss of so what market maker did it they just star liquidity provider you want to sell it see there is sell stop right means the others are seller they bought from them because they are selling they bought this loss and here there are lot of buyer why because it's a buy stop so they bought this loss sold to them simple as that they did nothing they did nothing it's a more of logic building why market can come to this lows and why market can go to that highs look at from this view market first engineered the sellers that you sell at this point then market engineered 
somebody should be buying that high see buyer should be there see if market makers buy that position if nobody is there to liquidate them in the sense like you know uh, if there is no much liquidity where they are going to sell that if they are buying that lows where they'll sell that so they have to take care of both the sides they take care of both the parties like they are building first lows that they can buy and then they engineered the highs also where they can sell where there are already buyers sitting there and there are a lot of sellers sitting so there was sellers they bought from this lows and there was buyer they sell to them simple as like that i hope i haven't confused it right i think some messages was there can you show some example of this how to trade in their situation is experience this is good is there any Yeah, I can talk about the confirmation entry. I'll come to that few minutes, okay? And when turtle soup happens, the breaker kind of breaker confirms that turtle soup, right? So that I'll I'll be coming. So I hope this this is not having any doubts, right? So far, if I have talked about this one, so uh, I'm uh, nothing, no doubts in this one, right? How to determine the daily bias in your style? I told you, you know, when price is rejecting the lows and breaking the highs. that says market is bullish or second way is when price is respecting the bullish pdrs and disrespecting the bullish pdr sorry bearish pdrs that says market is bullish and if you do the opposite you can get the bearish scenario right i told you in the usd cat why i was bullish just because price was rejecting the lows and breaking the highs so that made me to think that i am bullish i got you okay now see here second thing comes is i talked about the time but uh, most of the time you will see there are news is right in the forex factory you will see there are most of the time there will be some sort of news so news is also event which is time so instead of 3 am you can expect the manipulation say for example today is fomc so it's a day whole day within that given days that was the ma major event which is going to take place for that particular day so what market can do is either market will manipulate prior to the news and it will distribute with the news or market can accumulate and you know manipulate with the news or it can do three of them like accumulation was done it will manipulate and distribute both so what you can do is within two cases you can take the entry whether it's a fomc or whatsoever i don't care i trade news i trade news and i go with the daily time frame and one hour time frame with the this kind of heavy driver news i never get slippage why because i am trading the higher time frame not with the one minute if you trade one minute you will get the slippage you don't plan the day because you see fomc is there so the day will have major event which is going to take place that is fomc so prior to that you should not be trading or after that also you you will be expecting some different thing to happen it is not that price will be keep giving the setups it can give but don't take that keep in mind that for that particular day what is the most important time there is no session timing the major important thing is that particular news so plan based on that let us assume one scenario there is a fomc which is about to happen today somebody open the mic yeah who, who is this you can ask say for example this is the entire day okay let us assume this is the day and uh, today fomc is about to happen okay you know that that there is a news and how do you know because of the forex factory thanks to them okay so you know that there is a news today which is going to happen now what can be the ideal plan to do that first of all you will be seeing what price is doing determine the bias in terms of weekly or at least in terms of daily and with that first idea will be to look for the directional bias now assume that 
you were bullish because uh, I took the USD CAD trade as a bullish and my eyes goes uh, to this point, right? Just assume it. My eyes is looking for this point that price will push that or news or anything will push the price to the given area. Where is that? This is the area which price will push it. Now what can happen ideally? If the news is on Wednesday, don't get me, uh, you know that why you are telling the FMC on Wednesday or something like that. I am just taking example, try to understand the situation. I am trying to frame the logic here. If the news is on Wednesday, ideal will be Tuesday should be accumulation. And with the accumulation next day, it can be the manipulation, right? Let us assume that Tuesday had a range. This was the one candle, one single candle which was had a range. Now you identified your bias was bullish. Why? Because price was rejecting the lows. So in that case, you will look for some sort of higher time frame. Is there any order block? Is there any sell side? See, sell side is also a higher time frame. PDR is. Is there any sell side which is there? Or is it some sort of fair value gap which is there and price is accumulated here. So what will be the ideal scenario if news is about to happen at this particular point. Let me put it that also. See here. Price news will come here. Right. So there will be three things which can potentially happen. See it's a probability game. You are trying to frame your probability in terms of this. What happens is in one hour time frame, you are monitoring the price. The entire London was consolidation or even if London was not consolidation, like say, for example, London was trendy. So don't get confused by that trendy because price is within this given range. This is the range. See, you ask me, how do you define the range? This is my range. This is called range. Don't look at the lower time frame. Lower time frames are just an illusion. You have to take the entry based on the lower time frame, but framing the idea, framing the liquidity, framing the, you know, the expansion, it should come from the higher time frame. What exactly? See, you are trying to trade one higher time frame candle and lower time frame is giving you the entry that where you can enter into the lows, into the week, right? If it is a bullish, even anything below the open price is a good area to buy that lows, right? So. In London, whether price is accumulating or trending, that should not be your concern. This is the main range. And when price did something like it manipulated before the news. So what do you see here? Price has accumulation. Price has manipulation. So now you can anticipate that news will kick in and it will distribute the price. Scenario number one. Right? Scenario number two can be, I'll change the color for this. Okay. One sec. Price was entirely accumulating till this point. Okay. So now you see that price is completely accumulating throughout the period. So you can anticipate that news will come and it will manipulate. So what you can do here? Will you trade? Yes, you can trade. Either you can expect that this will manipulate so you can take the entry here and target this fair value gap or you wait for price to tap into this and then you can expect the next move towards the upside because see accumulation, manipulation and then distribution. Simple as that, right? Framing the entire idea with this or third thing can be happen that price will come accumulate and uh, with the news it can you know what happens now suddenly there will be a spike price was completely accumulating spiked during the news and then within the news it targeted the range high also in the sense the uh, draw liquidity what you do here nothing simply go away this third scenario is not made for you simply you should be interested in these two scenarios so these three things only can happen right so now you guys tell me whether it made some sense or not. See, I, I, I talked about entirely based on logic there. See, if you notice within this entire uh, session, I have not talked single time about any PDRs. Did I said any PDR is important? No, not at all. I just tried to make the logic behind that. 
now i'll give you one more thing uh, when range is there how to take the confirmation entry before moving to that i'll ask dinesh is there anything you can ask and i think some bro is putting some chat i guess okay uh, hello bro oh, sorry to interrupt like uh, uh, can you give me one more example of a daily time for analysis with other one random per after completing your uh, uh, range explanation if if possible yeah sure i'll take into that uh, i'll try to look for some example uh, into the daily and we'll see yep thank you bye nice and I, yeah and uh, is, is it going in a good way or like is is there good yeah you are good bro it's clear totally clear <laughs> okay now let us come to one of the example okay and uh, it shows me here okay uh, maybe what was that guy named dinesh yesterday we saw the tweet uh, that uh, what is what do you see here that romeo i said no that he replied something yeah i'll take his example i'll i'll give one confirmation example from, from that what was the name Hey guys, look at his chart. Watch it. He posted. This is a, a New Zealand JPY chart of old dates. And uh, if you notice out here, this one can. Yeah, perfect. What do you see, guys? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Right. No, what do you think from here? If you want, uh, you can show in your system also. That's fine. I'll I'll be really happy to do. <laughs> Jixi bro is here or gone? He got bored. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> cool. cool. Uh, what chat, the no, time no, frame no. of this chart? Uh, no, can see, first, no, no, one second, one second, one second. Uh, bro, I'll tell all of you. When you see this kind of chart, and if you ask the time frame, it's a uh, kind of insulting to the Frank. If you ask me, if you would identify the range, no, I know that I explained about the time. But see, certain thing is happening at the right time only. So don't ask. You just look at the price and tell me the price. You frame the time when you are trading really. But uh, there, there are certain things which is happening here. I told you what can be the best possible, what are the things which makes it here. So you just tell me buys or sells and where do you buy? If you buy it, uh, you can put in chat. See, if you're not comfortable enough, you put into the chat, sort. Price rejects the bearish PDL, so it's buy. Push to hell, okay? Okay. <laughs> I didn't even saw your messages, bro. Buys, buys. I see more of buys. Think heavy candle doing the turtle soup. Sort, sort, sell, sell. Okay, cool. I will buy at the FPG looking for model 2022. Okay. Buy and sell in upper FPG. Buy and sell, bro. You will do both, bro. <laughs> okay, cool, cool. Bro, 2022 is model is scam, bro. <laughs> yeah i think we'll go to the chart okay uh because see uh, you remember yesterday after po see uh yeah see i posted it this was my chart and then we found it out where this chart come from okay and i'll go to the chart and i'll explain it there see this was my this was my proper see he posted i just took the screenshot and i i write it like that this was not that i have seen it something and then we found it out where it is 
but uh, because to see the result to to see the result where i was right or wrong so that seeing that result but i marked this one and i'll explain it to you what made me to do that it was a new zealand pair okay and uh, luckily that fellow gave the date and time so we can go to the 12th of january <laughs> that was visible here look at this size where this one. where was that February. Oh, it's a fab only, right? Right, right. Sorry. It's a January 12th. Right. Out here. See, look at this fair. This is what he posted. So let me explain it to you here. See, simple as that. Sometime there will be some sort of news which is about to happen. See, what I said is always, always go with the time. But time is important, but news and events are more important. When there are certain news, then you will expect certain things to happen on a certain time or certain date. Say, for example, this entire week was a consolidation. Look at the naked eye, right? What do you see here? It's a complete consolidation. Simple as that. Right? Don't you see that? It is a complete consolidation. I'm, I know that you didn't see it here. But uh, this was a consolidation which is here. This was a clear cut protraction or whatever you say it that I said it. Many will be sorted. Let's see. Look at the logic here again. <laughs> what do you see here is price broke this structure. So many have been sorted here. Right? Correct? Those who sorted generated lot of liquidity out here now there is a buy stops right this is buy stops completely buy stops are pending from all the way to these points right now there are buyers right there are buyers sorting means you are selling the first and you are buying back right so you will be selling it first means you need a buyer if you want to sort the market you should have the buyer and market generated lot of buyer in the given area from this entire area market generated lot of buyer price taken into this area sold to the persons who are willing to buy those highs the dumb trader romeo says the smart trader is who is selling the highs buying the lows not the retailer or anything Everything works, even flicking whatever. Nah. I have learned. Yeah, I'll tell. I'll come to that also. I'll give some confirmation and tricks. Just we are discussing. Yeah. No, no, no. I'm not saying. See, uh, uh, with my line, I said the first thing which I came to the session, I said everything works and nothing works. It. Yeah. No, it's just no, it's just enough. So what market it is? Market sold here, right? Market sorted, net sort, right? Now market is sort. Market maker need to buy back the position. They have to mitigate their the position which they sold it to generate the profit. Otherwise, if price will be keep going higher, they will be into the negative. But what do you see here? Market generated another sort of liquidity pool within this loss. Look at this beautiful loss. And what market did again post down and see where is the retracement? I'll come to the retracement. See, there was a confirmation entry that I'll show it to you, but uh, forget that as of now. Is there any retracement? No, not at all. Market when market is done their work, then there will be not be the retracement, it will be keep pushing to the lows. Look at this loss, all this loss was intact. There was a lot of loss which was intact on market took out all the lows and this was some sort of weekly plan see look at this frame accumulation manipulation and distributions towards the entire next week again see 
So what what with the naked eye, what do you see here? Market accumulates, manipulates, accumulates, manipulates, accumulates, manipulates, distributes. This is what keep happening. And with the proper logic, you can build that idea, right? This was another one of the example which you can look into the trading. Okay. Now one example of uh, GBP, we can take it. No, no position swing. Otherwise, people will take the entry. <laughs> we can no, no, the markings which I have marked, this is my plan, but if data changes, I change my plan. Yeah, that is what. See, look at this range, right? This was some sort of news which pushed the price towards the downside and then what price made is again started accumulating near to the lows and there was a news on this particular time see I was in position of sort into the EU I sorted this position out here uh, somewhere into these areas and I was expecting price lower but price accumulated within this area so I was knowing that this loss will not be taken and I existed my position somewhere into this area before the news because I was expecting price will manipulate and fly higher but did that make that I will take the buy position no it was against my plan I didn't take it but I was knowing this is going to happen see what happened price distributed and now what happening price is completely accumulating above this loss and we know that there was a news Right, look at the news even price takes down and the as soon as see why didn't had a, any sort of week here. Did you ask ever yourself that this was a news? Why price didn't had any week? I just made the week. Okay, don't think that it's a week. <laughs> okay. There was no week at all. Then there was no logic behind price to go lower. It is already manipulated. This was the accumulation. And this was the manipulation is already done just one minute above the new, before the news. And what is the logic behind that price will keep dig down? Not there is nothing. So in that given case, the news was there to to push the price towards the expansion side right market maker created the loss say look at this beautiful loss right market maker created all this loss they took out that loss so price has to target this size and maybe next target this area and then this area right so they took out that loss just one minute before the news but that itself saying it will manipulate and that is done so now price will go higher and price didn't had single wick also. There was no wick at all. The, the moment candle opened and run. Look, there is no wick at all. Even in any pair, even in Euro, there was SMT, I know, but there was no wick at all. Not a single wick. The moment it opened and flight, there was a wick in higher time. So look at the five minutes. There is a wick. Price is keep pushing higher see even in five minutes there was a heavy week into the side and but there is no downside and look at the keep pushing higher 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 so this was the another example of looking the market from different look at all this right? manipulation and then look at the distributions accumulation manipulation look at Look at this loss was taken out. How beautiful is this loss? Yeah, look at see. Look at this, bro. Ask me one example. Where this price is started? Look at this frame. Let us frame the idea now again. Ask me for the daily some random pair, bro. I didn't trade the gold, so for me it's a random. Dinesh asked me to check it, so I'll explain it to you. I see something here. This was the open price of the week. 
what will be the ideal case where I should start accumulating manipulate into the right level at the right time into the key level see price has expanded already there is the order block right it will be a higher time frame order block if you go to the some other frame maybe six hour four hour or some other time frame maybe or even daily if you look it uh, there was some uh, some weak area but i am not disconnected right Dinesh, my voice is correct. Okay. So even in daily, there was an order block. See, price just closed above this order block. So open price can be triggered as a high probability order block here. This was the order block. This was the open price, this, this area. So price can come and trigger to the order open price and push higher. Look at this beautiful delivery here. What price did is price accumulated created the lows near to the time where is the pdrs near to the pdrs it created the lows took out those lows at the right time see accumulation happened for the first two days as i told you sometime it can happen manipulation on the wednesday and look at the expansion price keep expanding and higher 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 and there was a lot of time daily see now you look at from this was the weekly profile now daily look at this open manipulated closed open manipulated higher open manipulated higher right this is what happening on a daily basis it was a clear what else it's a very clearest one i can say it Open accumulation, manipulation, distribution. Open accumulation, manipulation, distribution. Open accumulation, manipulation, distribution. Cleanest one. This was the cleanest, cleanest example I can see here. So the next mic is yours. So you can ask me any questions if you want. Otherwise, people can. There is SMT too, bro. Bro, I don't know, but I don't use much SMT to the frank. Come on. No, after this, I'll give you one example of uh, confirmation trade. Yeah, but uh, before that, any see my upper model. Uh, bro, I'll tell you one thing, but there is a software, okay uh i don't recommend buying or anything i am affiliate of this but uh, uh you know you can uh, use this kind of softwares there is a back testing see there is a daily journal section out here you can uh, look into this i think this yeah look at the march positions Okay, with one single trade, I passed it. There was some small positions, and then see, look at these things. I told you five days, right? Look at these five days. I don't lie, okay? I will not remember that it is connected here. That's okay, no, it's a part of the thing. But look at this thing, okay? So what I do is I use this journal. They have given me in free, but you have to buy it. You can try free five days. They have free five days. You can use my link if you want. But you can use the back testing session here. You can create the date and account balance and everything. And it's a kind of automated. And they are the, I think, lowest cost, I, I believe. I'm not sure. Even they are about to run some offers, so you can wait for some time. I, I I know that they are about to run the offer. So start from $19 per month. So maybe you can take one of the account. I know it can be costing, but uh, it's a good idea to have. I think trade delay is, see, there are good features, more good features, but that is quite expensive. It is not required. Yeah.
uh of course actually i was just monitoring some time uh, i was uh, see for me the problem was i am a very lazy as uh, to the point very very lazy as not not because i don't like doing it because i have a lot of works and i do plan a lot of things and i keep getting postponed because i am a full time uh, have office yeah i am not uh, you know full time trader i just i am a part time trader and apart from that community there are some other things which also i am running so there are a lot of few things so i was lazy enough that i could not able to journal it but i wanted to do it really so i decided to go with uh, these things and uh, after that what you can do is even take any trades you put it here and i was putting it last few trades i haven't put it because the phase is clear so what are you going to do is you going to write it here whatever you want it it can be saved here like say for example trade one I, what i was doing is trade one for this particular day if i am trading multiple so i'll put it as this way then i'll post my chart and what is my views on this one i'll write it there and then again i'll come to post that chart and post view something like that i'll put it and uh, on the weekly i No, no. I'm not asking you to buy it from Mylink. Also, if you wish, you can take it. Otherwise, it's up to you. You can. It's better not. Yeah. <laughs> it's a kind of say who asked me the confirmation entry right i'll show you here uh let us assume this is my range okay i'm not giving any signals here okay i'm just telling you overall <laughs> i don't trade this pair uh, bro uh, actually this is what i'm asking like by the time you was uh, explaining about the daily time frame and marking highs and lows so i was joining late so uh, that's what i'm asking daily time frame analysis if you, if you could explain again it will be better for me so if possible. no no we have a recording if you join late you can watch it no uh this is clear rejection and i'll wait for this highs to be taken out so see what i do here is uh, sometime you will get rejections like this and then you can come to the lower time frame maybe look at this 30 minutes it's a close right but into the 1 hour it's a rejection it didn't close so i what i'll do is i'll wait for price to reject into the execution or you know the time frame where i am framing the buyers right like maybe one hour i don't want price to close below that but in 30 minutes on in 15 minutes i told you know 4 hour to 1 hour right so similarly from 1 hour to 30 minutes or 15 minutes both in both of the cases i want price to close aggressively below this lows and once price rejects above this area see say for example price invalidated here right if you notice here price just close above this open up if you ask me why did i select it so i this was kind of one single leg right this was one single leg right if you notice here right this was single low here so what i do here is as a confirmation entry once price closed above this here so any price coming back within some 5 to 10 minutes here i can buy this lows stop loss below this lows and uh, by that week i mean that uh, lows and uh, see again the, as dinesh says he is expecting lower prices what is the best way i look for the targets out here what i'll do is no no what i'm saying no no i'm what i'm trying to say here is 
the best way is always you can be wrong also you can be right also yeah so what you do is no no that is what i'm saying the best way is when price is going reaching to rejection block see if there is smt it can reject very well possible it cannot go to the high so you should book some partials that will save your somewhat see if price is rejecting your stops at break even and you have booked some tp maybe some 40 percent only not asking to close the entire 100 percent position let 60 percent to reach the target so this is what i am looking for this highs so we'll wait for that on the in euro i'm expecting this highs to be taken out then followed by this lows See, what I mean here is, what, what I mean here is, if it is not happening, if price keeps going higher, I will not trade. But does not mean that yeah, I will trade. No, price is going higher, I will trade. No, for me, as of now, plan is, I will wait for price to take out this size. And the way, see, look at this here. My plan and your plan is complete contradiction. <laughs> that is why I am total soup trader. <laughs> See, look at this range, right? This was the range. And see, uh, again, if you ask me, there is no certain rule to mark that low. In this case, I'm expecting this range low itself as a turtle soup, right? I told you more on more why I make it that way. Mm. Don't get my drawings as that way. More of like it's a logic building. See, what do I see here is in Euro price has accumulated a lot in this area. So now accumulation is done. If, if, see. Now, there is a one more question. It's a four hour range, right? If you notice here, it's a clear 4H range, hmm. right? It's a 4H range. What happens if price closes above this into the 4H? Then I will expect price will take out this highs and then it will reject. Tell, and if it rejects, okay, okay. Can't complete, complete. If, if it rejects, then I'll take it. And again, if closes again, say, for example, now again, what happens? There was a smaller range. What price makes is price makes a smaller range here mm. and then it closes again above this. Then I have changed my bias that no, now I am chasing the price. I am just forcing my buyers. Now I am wrong. I will be away from the market. The first case will be price will reject from this loss in 4H mm. because it's a 4H plan. In 1H, it is close and then the next candle should reject. But what happens? I look into the 4H and 4H is like clear cut close up of that so next i'll wait for the smaller range to form and a smaller range not forms and it keeps going higher then it's i'm wrong and if price makes a smaller range here then that smaller range will be the turtle soup and then also i'll expect that this will reject see i'll take the entry but my stops will be based on the pdrs like say for example in this case the size will be my you know when the stops and uh, i'll expect this loss to be taken out if not happening, I'll get my stops very, very, very simple. Uh, uh, people simple. don't, people don't get it. So digest it. Mm. Stops is a part of the game. game yeah. What do you see here? My winning percent. No, see, there are multiple. <laughs> trades. No, no. Uh, why it is showing that less now? Because XRP was having a very high lot size and the MT4 not, sorry, MT5 spread don't allow. Spread. Yeah. No, not spread the lot. Okay. okay. Like I have. Uh, for taking my risk, my risk was five hundred dollars. Okay. So for taking that five hundred dollars, I have to take some uh, five thousand quantity. Sorry, five thousand lots. Mm -hmm. But the MT five was having uh, max lot is thousand. You cannot buy more than that. Mm -hmm. So I have to take five positions. And there was I closed it some some near to the break even. See, this was near to the break even only. Mm -hmm. So I have to close. So one trade was five trade closing five SLs like that. It shows in terms of system. But don't get confused by this. And look at this. With this 27 or take it as it was somewhere around 50% RR. Mm. Not 50%, go to the daily journal. Here you will get it out of, mm. out of uh, one, two, three was winning this and two was losing this. So somewhere around 45%, right? Mm. So out of 45, I made it, right? So except the fact the losses will be there. See, maximum loss I had in a day was 1400. Mm. The maximum profit was 5800. Thanks.
Yeah, like there will be differences in opinion at the end of the day. So of course, gonna... of course it will be there. See, he is having different plan. I am having different plan. I am so wrong maybe, and I'll change my plan. Simple like as that. Maybe, maybe, maybe like we having uh, our plans uh, different. But yeah, we can end up in both wins or we can both end up in losses. That That's completely uncertain. Like this making plans or not, it's an edge. That's it. Just See, no. Edge is following your plan. plan. Yeah, perfect. Great. Don't say that edge is winning 100%. <laughs> winning 20% and following your plan 100% is your edge. Mm. Yeah. And once you have edge, you can be profitable yeah. with the 20%. Mm. For the example, you see it here. What do you see? With the 27%, I am 5% up, right? People so that's it. want 100% in this, bro. People yeah, so that is not the edge. All... And of course, risk management is the key. I shown my win rate for my phase one. It was around uh, 50, 55 something, I guess. But on the total, on the total, it was around 55. No, the win rate is showing less because of the multiple but positions of that. But yeah. what I'm trying to say here is, if you, even if it is a right, let's assume it's a right. Even right. if it's an one dollar loss, no. Even if you are making it as a break, even if it is a one dollar loss, also it will be showing considering loss only. No, no, that's okay. Forget about that. What I'm trying to say is following the plan is edge and with that you can make money. Mm. It is nowhere linked that you should be winning some 20 trades, then you will make the money. No, with the 10 trades winning out of 50 trades losing, also you can make the money. Right. So focus on these things and so, you know, there are a lot of Twitter accounts, you, you know, but don't get influenced by each other's yeah, opinions. Yeah. Like better you don't to open Twitter, bro. First of all, you should stick to one person or one yeah, idea. Like stick to one mentor, whoever it is. Just stick to one. Stick to one because like ICT content is very vast. Okay, so uh, uh, like uh, going through all of it, uh, it's a long process, lonely process. So better, better like stick with the mentor. Like it could be. Ter See, I'm not just recommending. I've I've seen everything. Like I've 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 been in Twitter for. A Bro, it's done more than one, one and a half years to two years now, no, bro. One and a half years, right, exactly. We started in November or December, right? Uh, our friendship. No, ah, you are long back, no? You are from long back. No, no, I started, yeah, it's it's going to be around two years and you started around two, two and a half years around, no? Two and a half to three years back. In ICT. Yeah, ICT. Like in Twitter also. Yeah, right. Ah. The, during the tutor only, I started ah, ICT. ICT yeah. <laughs> like, we, we've been there in the space for so long and we have seen everything. Like, good, like, find one good person, bro. I don't want to mention his or her name. Find one good person, follow them. Like, so, so Suman bro followed uh, Romeo. Like, uh, See, that's what I'll, uh, sorry, the yeah, yeah. I know that Romeo is bad guy. Yeah. He's a bad marketer or whatever. I don't care about that. Mm. He taught me yeah. even I, so even now he gives some information look at i'll show you something i'm not allowed no, to do no, so no 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 just 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 overall i'm saying see look at i am talking to here and uh, where is that group i you have a he comes also, no? no not telegram, uh, telegram, um, telegram okay. yeah look at this chef mm -hmm. this is created by romeo and there is only four people mm -hmm. so what i'm trying to say here is I gave my 100% to him. Yeah. His things is working for me. I am able to make money because of his concepts. Mm -hmm. He is a bad marketer. He, is, he talks bad. He talks it. I don't care. Mm -hmm. I stick to him. I don't follow somebody else. For example, now people are following many of them, the MMXM trader. You yeah, follow like him follow, alone. Yeah, just yeah. stick to one guy. Like I have, one, I've, yeah. I've never stick to one since the beginning. But yeah, you guys, if you want to see... No, for you, your case is different. You are a content creator. You should be going with multiple things. I to go sometimes, but not for trading. For my trading, for my personal thing. Trading, I will tell you, na. trading myself, uh, I have uh, followed two people, to be honest. One is Ali Khan and uh, one is the MMXM trader, other than ICT himself. So, I uh, like Ali Khan gave me some better understanding about... Uh, uh, what do I tell you? The, the the concept he like to be honest he complicated those concepts to be honest. But the MMXM trader has made it very simple. Yeah, like I I wouldn't say I've learned from this particular guy or the particular guy, but I have learned from so many bro. 
like uh, whomever fi- follow i learn from them like i follow uh, i've learned so much from suman bro also vikas also zex also zex zex taught me a lot about uh, uh, this inter market analysis and everything i've i've learned ranges from uh, suman bro and vikas bro like i have learned uh, cst better from them like i've learned uh, uh, like small small pieces from lot of people like i have put it together okay we'll take few questions are there dinesh yeah. Sure. Is drawdown is equity based on daily or total balance? How it works? Okay. See, see, bro. Uh, it depends. On, on the it depends on the firms. forms to forms. If you be specific about any form, then I can be able to answer. But no, it is no, a like... don't be specific. Don't answer anything about profits. It's better we yeah. avoid it. Can you provide your scandal as arranges? Okay, fine. I'll take this question. I'll answer you it. Have trade that, you have that trade return, no? You have that trade return, no? You just show them, no? vikas ah, yeah. also like return a threat no like you can just show them trade opinion bro why are you choosing that higher than your brother ayota who is romeo he was mentored before too who is romeo he was mentored mentored before too. romeo is a guy bro romeo is a guy who like uh, made this turtle soups very famous not famous like he he used it he used what to do if i have confusions if you have confusions don't, don't trade. trade don't trade seriously don't trade and also i forgot to mention another guy dexter like i have i have uh, i have huge respect for him uh, his standard deviations as like gave me so much confidence in holding trades and everything i have to give credits so see now i'll answer two question at the same bro ask me why did you select it that this size why not this size or even this size so what do you see is there is a one candle and there are a lot of candle within that range so this is the range high this is the range low and there is a lot of price action so that is why selected this as a high this as a low so this is the accumulation there will be manipulation onto higher side i expect it can manipulate lower also then i'll be wrong simple as that but my plan is it will ha- manipulate higher side and then it will go down so this this is what the reason i selected as a this candle high and this candle low question number 1 answer now second explain candle as a low or range see every candle is having lower time frame story right if you try to understand from the one candle story one 4 hour candle if you go into the 15 minute there will be a lot of candle within that range right so one 4 hour candle can be the range of 15 minutes so that is why you take the first a one 4 hour candle as accumulation which will be 5 minute range see here this is a range right so one 4 hour candle can be the this is daily candle like look at this range see this is one candle within that candle price close so in daily this is that in weekly there is nothing so this one sorry three day one candle as a range i assumed that this is the range if i go to the lower time frame if it is framing that way i'll go with that i go into the 4h and this is perfectly framing so similarly i'll take 4h candle at the range first candle as accumulation or range the second candle i'll expect that as a manipulation and the third candle i can anticipate as a distribution so that is why this is the range as a candle as a range but this is a lower time frame range accumulation manipulation and distributions nothing else hope i got answer clear <laughs> i think that's all on anything you have to say or we should yeah it's better we close everything has been explained very good like i was expecting this kind of conversations only better than this meet and uh, like doing presentations this random talks are good bro <laughs> can i explain how to trade news and info about currency correlations bro that is a separate topic and i told you i'll be doing it in another vc currency correlations is kind of some some vast thing i'll make sure to do that okay i promise uh, if you'll ask me to answer then it will be not yeah <laughs> yeah yeah if you if you ask him na he'll say you no need all that thing but yeah to have some higher confidence in your holding trades and you, you need i guess uh, to uh, and also to like uh, uh, select which pairs as low resistance liquidity and it would be better if you do some ca- cross currency analysis and you know the beauty is there see we me and dinesh both are friends mm-hmm. he trade something else i trade something yeah. else and we respect each other why because i know for his that is thing is working for me this is working so what we are trying to do is go with the egs thing whatever you can digest everything works oh yeah see, every human being is not the same now one thing same, right uh, mm-hmm. if you think that you are not able to understand mmxm but you are getting better into the turtle soup you go with the turtle soup 
but you sometimes see that oh turtle soup is confusing then why the hell you will put your head and brain into that particular thing which is not good for you uh, no uh, my word can be different but uh, don't get me wrong but what i'm trying to say is don't go into that direction go with the easiest thing simple simplicity is the key here the more you the more you put it the more confusion the less you do the less confusion and the more clarity and the more clarity will give you more results it's a probability game not the setup game yeah. so go with the probability sort of things yeah bro i just wanted to let you know to make another like next session like any insights yeah if you want he can do if he is free i'll ask him he is he is another guy kind of yeah bro, because if you like If you check in YouTube, right? There's no video explaining properly. You check how much ever you want. You don't have any video on correlation and how to trade during news. Every bullshit but is available. But why would you want to trade during news, bro? I'll explain correlations, but I'll no. I'll explain. I'll tell you like how news would do things. Okay, it could either do, it could either do manipulation or distribute directly. So th- that is that is that is the thing. I'll explain it in another. Yeah, bro, but you should get the. I'll explain. Yeah, I'll 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 ah, okay. do the session to do that maybe next week or. Okay, know. okay, thank you. Yeah, sure, bro. Because I, like I was planning on uh, doing hedging on using this. Okay, 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 okay. Sure, sure, sure. I'll I'll I'll, I'll to try to provide as much as value I could to the community. Thank you, Ji. Yeah, sure. Thank you, bro. Suman, so, bro, is there something you want to tell, or we shall close? I have crossed seven k. That is what I want to say. Ah, congratulations, bro. <laughs> Thanks, bro. Man, I think the seven k. Guys, guys, see this, bro. Eating la. Even the link motto put on the line. Yeah, we are not. We are not. The Twitter, Suman bro, the Twitter link motto put. Ah, that put. Ah, that put. Ah, that put. Congratulations, bro. Thanks for the lecture. Nah, thank you. Thanks, bro. <laughs> Thanks. I'll just close the recording. Otherwise, we'll yeah, sure, sure, sure. Like I will also. Play. I'll run. I'll. Uh, I think we don't have uh, like lot of uh, uh, things, so I'll upload it directly. I guess I'll just correct the audio if there is some issue, and uh, I'll upload it directly. But some part of the video, the things I spoke wouldn't have been recorded because I switched off my mic in OBS. <laughs> Guys, if you want to follow, here is his Twitter uh, link, and uh, you could go follow for insights for setups. No, for more of like, what do you see? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> which i'm allowed why to do the by the room yeah the room you will put <laughs> chinese copy of room <laughs> uh, big fan no one no, no fan i think just bro <laughs> oh ho oh. celebrity celebrity he is a celebrity bro trade yeah. he is a celebrity of mansion like which are you anna ji come on <laughs> sir okay, okay na Bye okay, bye. Bye. Thanks for the lecture. Bye. And thank yeah. You bye guys. Bye bye. Take care. Yeah. Good night guys. Bye bye. Bye bye bye. Okay. Hello. Thank you guys for joining. And it's been Sunday. Hope you had some good weekend. Good luck. Good trading for next week. And uh, we'll meet in the next lecture. Hopefully, if we have someone, we'll meet there. Bye guys. Bye bye bye. Thank you. Thank you for joining.